After a three-year absence at state, the War Road girls hockey team made it back in a big way last year with a third place finish in the Class A state tournament. Now the Warriors are headed back to state for the second straight year with a bigger goal in sight. Coming into this season, the War Road girls hockey team had only one goal in sight, win Section 8A and get back to the state tournament. Now, after downing East Grand Forks in the section championship, the Warriors are headed to their eighth state tournament in the past 11 years. It was seriously the best feeling ever. Like, it's one of those moments where you, it's like the best thing. You can't even describe it. It's so good. It doesn't get old. And we beat a, we beat a really good East Grand Forks team to get there, and uh, our whole crew is excited about it. With that section tournament in the rearview mirror, the Warriors are shifting their attention to state and the opponents that lie ahead. Blake's a heavy favorite. They deserve that. Um, I think St. Paul United deserves their number two seed. They're, they're a good hockey club, and they're both very well coached. But uh, like I said, we're going to worry about Wednesday, and then we're going to worry about what's next after that. They say there's going to be no secret formula to success, and they're just going to have to do what they do well to survive in advance. We know how to win. We know how to work together. Um, we know what we have to do to win, so I think we have a really good chance. We're going to need Emma to be good in the nets, and we're going to have to play good team, good team defense. And uh, we've got to be opportunistic up front. We need, we need to put some pucks in the net. Kind of the same old stuff. The Warriors have never finished worse than third place when they've gone to state. And this year's team is ready to put their mark on the program. Looking up to all these girls that have been state champions in 2010, 2011, that's, that's been my number one goal is to be a state champion just like those girls were. Hopefully everyone um, gets there and, and has their best game, doesn't have too many deer in the headlight uh, moments, but uh, hopefully we just go down there and, and, and play the best hockey we can. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.